Hi everybody, it's Heather from Art Explorium. Uh, we miss seeing you so much in the studio, but we hope you're all doing well at home. Uh, we wanted to start maybe doing some story times with some of our favorite books that we read in the studio uh, that can help inspire creativity with your keiki at home. So we hope you enjoy. Uh, this is our first one. So I'm gonna be reading one of our favorites. It's called Mouse Paint. It's by Ellen Stoll Walsh. So here we go. Once there were three white mice on a white sheet of paper. The cat couldn't find them. One day while the cat was asleep, the mice saw three jars of paint. One red, one yellow, and one blue. They thought it was mouse paint. They climbed right in. Then one was red, one was yellow, and one was blue. They dripped puddles of paint onto the paper. The puddles looked like fun. The red mouse stepped into the yellow puddle and did a little dance. His red feet stirred the yellow puddle until, what color do you think he's gonna make? Look, he cried. Red feet in a yellow puddle make orange. The yellow mouse hopped into a blue puddle. His feet mixed and stirred and stirred and mixed until, what do you think? Look down, said the red mouse and the blue mouse. Yellow feet in a blue puddle make green. Then the blue mouse jumped into a red puddle. He splashed and danced until, what do you think? Purple, they all shouted. Blue feet in a red puddle make purple. But the paint on their fur got sticky and stiff. So they washed themselves down to a nice soft white. Can you see where they washed themselves down? Cat's not gonna be happy. And they painted paper instead. They painted one red part and one yellow part, and one part blue. They mixed red and yellow to paint an orange part, yellow and blue to paint a green part, and blue and red to paint a purple part. But they left some white because of the cat. Hope you enjoyed that. Uh, we'll start doing some more of these as we go along and we're also posting um, some art activities that are easy to do at home uh, with supplies that you have on hand. You don't need to go buy new supplies for most of our projects. So we'll keep on posting those and I hope you enjoy. Check out our Facebook and our Instagram for more information. Take care, miss you guys, see you soon, bye.